Women don't want men that don't have nobody. They don't want a man that's not dealing with a woman already. They want a man that's already affiliated with women. They want him already talking to her. They want him already in action. They want him already smashing. According to my clients and the, the guys that I consult, most of the guys that are single and available, even if they're attractive and have a lot going on for themselves career-wise, they are having major problems with women. It's the guys, my clients that's already smashing and dealing with women and have women on their roster, those are the guys that are attracting more women. And that's why most women end up at the short end of the stick because they are attracted to the guys that's already eating. They are attracted to guys that's not in need, that's already full. So they waste the best years of their life trying to go after a man that's already eating instead of a man that's in need, that can appreciate them, that is hungry. Whether he is attractive, cool, financially stable, in shape, tall, it don't matter. It's something about the energy, it's something about the energy of a man when he's already dealing with women and and he's not needy and he's not hungry and he just don't care they are very attracted to that they can smell it on a man a mile away and they just keep being a cycle over and over and over and the same guys that they didn't give a chance to or they didn't let hug or smash or they didn't go out with or Netflix and chill Once those guys when a woman finally say you know what? I don't know how how he slipped through the cracks That same woman gonna see him With another woman that looked better than her a better body Nicer more cooperative more unselfish more cleaner more smoother more virtuous more healthy more feminine and she gonna say I remember him girl I remember him I kept brushing him off I never answered his texts back I don't know how I, I don't know why I treated him like that he is handsome look at that pretty girl he with how did I let him get away 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 you see they can't see you until somebody else grab you. You are invisible until you're already taken or you're already pre-selected. You are invisible. I'm talking to you, yeah, you. You right there. You got everything going on. Nothing is wrong with you, but everything is wrong with them, you know why? Because Satan is in them. And you know who Satan is? The devil. He's the author of confusion. And he have most women confused. They're confused. That's why they haven't chosen you yet, man. They got demons inside of them. They have the curse of Jezebel. They are confused. By the way, whoever sent me that gospel, um, that gospel thing earlier to my Instagram, I watched it. I love the music. I'm going to watch it again. I appreciate you so much. Whoever sent me that, I got to look back at the name. Whoever sent me that um, to my um, Instagram, salute. Really, that nation, much love. I love gospel music. I love gospel rap. I got to get, they rap better than the mainstream rappers. You know what I'm saying? So I got to get back listening to the gospel rap because they sound really good. And they talk about something that's nutritionist for the soul and the mind. Ain't no use to keep rapping about the other stuff that's hurting everybody and keeping them stuck and in the matrix. I'm going to listen to some gospel rap. You know, we got to support those gospel rappers that's talking about 
stuff like they used to talk about back when we was little, about, you know, about the life and the change in the world. And we got to get that back on all that destruction, devil rap. No, no, no. We got to ban, we got to, we got to let go of that devil rap. But just remember, brother, it's not you. It's them. It's the devil and the evil in them. No need for you feeling insecure. You're not too short. You're not too tall. You're not too big. You're not too fat. You're not, you're not, you don't look like a monster. They'll deal with you. If you had a pretty girl on your shoulder, you could be two feet tall. And you can look like a gremlin. And they'll still love you and treat you like the best thing since cream cheese. So don't worry about that. Okay? Don't be concerned about that. I'm Alan Ray in there. Everything you need is in the description box. Everything. The song that you heard in the beginning is called Alan Williams, the Rillionaire. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. We rebuke the devil in the name of Jesus. Okay? And uh, all Patreon members, much love. Salute. We have a new Patreon member. I'll, I'll mention his name on the next video. But a uh, salute to the new Patreon member. We got uh, many of them. I'm just, I had one of them in my, their names in my head. I forgot. But um, much love to you. If you want a one-on-one -on -one consult with me, send me a message on Instagram. The Instagram link is in the description box. So uh, send me a message and let me know how much time you want. Make sure you have a cash app or PayPal. I don't have a Zelly. I don't feel like making one. So uh, much love to you, and uh, stay prayed up. Check out my books, everything. Check out all the links in the description box. All newcomers, don't forget to press like, subscribe, hit the bell, so you can be notified for the next video. Much love to you. I'm Alan Reina. I'm out. What's up, Rillionaire Nation? This your brother, Alan Rillionaire, Alan Williams, the Rillionaire, the Rillionaire, AWTR. I'm all in one. Here to let you know if you want your Pookie and Ray Ray Rillionaire Anthem shirts, send me a message on Instagram along with your shirt size and everything. And, uh, let me know your address, and um, the shirts are $50, so you pay, and then let me know your size and address, and the shirt will get sent to you, okay? And any other shirts that you want from me, let me know, and I'll send it to you to send me the information, and I'll send it to the Cash App or PayPal, $50, and your shirt will be on the way ASAP. Much love to you. Reading Nation, I'm out.